All right, it's come time to look at the IP command. And you might be asking, what's that? I don't recognize that command. And if you're not a Linux user, you probably wouldn't recognize that command. So let's look at the man page. The IP command shows and manipulates routing network devices, interfaces, and tunnels. What does this mean? This means that IP has taken the place of the IF config command on modern Linux systems. On macOS, you still have IF config because macOS derives from BSD Unix. And on Windows, you have the IP config command. The IP command has many variations. The most useful for most people is IP address show. But hey, that's too much typing. So you can shorten that down to IP space A. And as you can see, it's going to list the information about each of your network cards or devices on that particular machine. So here is the local device, EN01, ENS2F1, etc. Exiting out to the Mac side, we do IF config on EN0, which is the primary network device. It's going to give us back very similar information. And the key here is to know that they do vary across different systems. This is one of the commands that is pretty different between Linux, Mac OS, and Windows. You can, on Linux, install a package that will restore the IF config command. If that is something you need for legacy purposes, for compatibility purposes, you can still do that. How long that's going to be available, I don't know. But hey, at least you know what's going on and you can act accordingly. Thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.